What's good, Grey Gang? We're here today with me and Trey and Adam. Remember that video whenever I blew up the baking soda and vinegar bomb? We all got a whole lot more likes than 3,000. We got my gun, his gun, his baseball bat. We got a paint can, 15 corn on the cobs, and we got a whole case of old pop. We're about to make something blow up one way or another, I can tell you that. I don't know, boys. What are we shooting first? What are we hitting first? Let's go with the pop. All right, we'll pop us a good pop first. Y'all want to shoot a pop can first or just straight up smack it with a baseball bat? Let's shoot one first. Ah, right, yeah, we'll shoot one first. All right, boys, I guess Adam right here, he's going to shoot that pop can real quick shake it up real nice and then he's gonna pop it one time with his baby gun here we go boys i'm backing up for this one here we go son bust him one good time oh. wow that was pretty boring i ain't gonna lie it didn't do nothing it put a giant hole in this jewel. <laughs> oh man it did explode it just like, didn't make any sound at all this one's gonna be interesting here you go trey oh. i get the paint though boys i'm gonna toss it in from here and you hit it oh gosh you ready trey he's gonna smack this sucker it's stinking hard i can tell you that Oh my, it's off. Okay, here we go. Oh, that done it, didn't it? <laughs> He's dripping. Oh my, oh my, oh my. my. Corn on the cob dinger number two. Let's hit it. All right, hit it. Smack it. Oh, it hit me in the chest. There's a piece of corn on me. You got a piece of cream corn on my hand. It just exploded. Corn cob dinger part three. Hit it. Smack it. Dude, another piece of corn. Here, let me do it. Here's a real quick disclaimer, guys. I'm not a baseball player by any means at all. I quit at T-ball because it's getting too hot. <laughs> okay. Let's practice real quick. Yeah, let's just swing it. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. About time. <laughs> I only took five tries, but we done it. Oh, boys, let me get out of the way if you're slapping another pop real quick. It goes everywhere, I'll tell you that. You wet? And there is the aftermath of it. Just obliterated it. Oh, my gosh. You know, you got corn on your forehead. For real? <laughs> yeah, right. You got a knife? Right there. <laughs> okay, guys, well, we couldn't do anything to get my lid open, but we're going to shoot it with Adam's gun anyhow. You ready, Trey? Yeah, bro. Here you go. I can't shoot that. Boom! Oh. That'll work, that'll work. Okay, boys, now for one of the big parts. We got spray paint. Yeah. Anytime, Adam, anytime. Bust that sucker. Bust that sucker. Oh my gosh! <laughs> the ground's black. That's that's a fact. Me and Shelby today, you know, the knife boy. Bird gang. Bird gang. But anyways, right now we're about to do the MTB slam. Now we got a pro box. It's a bigger box, so it's going to be me and Shelby. You realize that whatever's in this box is the only means we have to catch fish. <laughs> okay, here we go. Moment of truth. Let's see what's in it. Here we go. Moment of truth. But first, guys, if you want to pick up one self, I finally got my own promo code, Grey Gang. It should be in the description, but first, finish this video. Then you can head on over and get you a pretty hefty discount off your first box. But for real this time, here we go. I'm just, no, I'm just kidding. Okay, here we go. Oh, wow. Let's see. What in the world? We huh? fish you with a sticker, boys. We fish you with a sticker. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All right, now here's the real stuff we got. Here we got this piece of paper. What we got there? Oh, dang, that's a stinking jerk bait, dude. That's expensive, too. And then here we got these little crawls. That's possible. That's possible. Oh, then we got a jig. And then we got this. I guess it's like a little top water bait. Yeah, it is a little top water bait. Then we got this giant spinner bait. That's actually a really good spinner bait for night because it's got that big black blade on it. And then we got these little beavers right here. Perfect plastic beavers. Then we got these bobber stops. We got a giant flipping hook right there. And then we got this little uh, scent, I guess. Is that juice? Yeah, that's orange juice, Shelby. Tear into it. But yeah, we're both going to pick a lure and then we're going to tear out them and into them. I believe Shelby's going to start off with the jerk bait. I'm actually going to start off, well, I think I'm actually going to start off with these crawls right here. I don't know how I'm going to rig them. Maybe Texas rig. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm going to Texas rig these. Here we go. First cast with this little crawdad. Hopefully, we can get a few. Oh my gosh. Why didn't he eat it the first hundred times I pulled it through there? Because he wasn't on top. He's trying to tell us something. They're keyed in the top water. Got him. Oh my gosh. I got one. He's a pretty good one too. Well, I lied about that part, but he is a fish. Okay, here we go. Finally, I finally got one. I fished this whole time bouncing this thing off the bottom and no bites, no bites. I mean, I, yeah, I got one at the beginning, but didn't really catch any. And then right there, I was just reeling it in, getting ready to make a new cast and this thing was skidding across the water. Boom, got a big old blow up. That told me that they was biting top water. So then I done the same exact thing. Second cast after that first fish told me he's biting top water. And then I got this little guy, but I mean, 
I'm gonna keep doing that, but now I gotta switch baits because I did complete this bait. I'm actually gonna switch right now to the top water. Video. Oh, there he is. Okay, here we go. On the big top water, baby. Big top water bait. We'll get him up here. He's a, he's a, acting so weird because I got him snatched right across the face. This guy wasn't coming off anytime soon. Nice little bass right there. Oh, there's a good one. Oh my gosh. That's a good one too. Bro, I got a giant. Oh my gosh. Hurry, Shelby, get over here. This is the good one. Oh my gosh. This is a good one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was a seven pounder. The good one. You gotta be kidding me. That was my PB. Oh my gosh. Boys, that was a seven pounder, I promise. That would have been my, that had been my lifetime PB. But he jumped off, so it's not anything. Now it's just a story. I know he was good one whenever he bit, but I didn't know he was that good. I've, I've, I've never hooked one that big in my life. Whenever I tied the spinnerbait on, I told you if I catch a fish, it's gonna be a good one. And boy, was it a good one. But it doesn't matter. I did got off. It's just, now it's just, a, now it's nothing. It's just a story now. Well, dang. The next day. What's good, Greg Gang? Wait, I know what you're thinking. You're you're like, dude, what are you doing? This isn't a new video. Why are you starting it again? Well, actually, it's a completely new day because you know, after I lost that seven pounder, I'm not gonna lie, guys, it sort of dampened my spirits. I went home, cried a little bit, but now I'm out here today, gonna try to finish the challenge. Well, actually, I can't finish the challenge. I just now remembered Shelby still has my jerk bait. However, I'm still gonna fish with my favorite baits in the box. Mystery Tackle Box really hit it good right here. They got the KVD Perfect Plastic, and these here are the smaller version of beavers, and they are stinking killer in ponds. I'll tell you right now, and I'm about to show you. But yeah, let me show you real quick. There he is, fish number one. I was sitting there playing with my little reel grips. One of y'all sent in the mail for me. I really do love them, guys. I'll tell you that right now, but uh, just sitting there playing with it. Felt my rod just like, you know, pulling down. And sure enough, buddy, that's a fish every time. Right there on that little beaver. There he is, not a big one, but I mean, hey, fish is a fish. Every, every fish is good right now. There he is, son. That's pretty good in there. Boys, I'm just a liar about fishing. Every time I say it's a good and it just turns out it's about the, about the dinkiest fish in the pond. We all know how that is, though. Every hook set feels good. This guy's got the shakes. There he is. Now, for those of you guys who are just getting into fishing or maybe not fishing right now, but you want to get into fishing, I'd highly recommend getting the mystery tackle box. Now, what this does is that even if you're a good fisherman, even if you fish all the time or you just like fishing stuff, dude, a mystery tackle box is the way to go. One of the funnest things to do is to come out here not knowing one thing about what's in the box, just coming down to the pond and open it on the pond bank or in your boat at the lake, either one, and just try and catch a fish on each bait. If you're already pretty good at fishing, that's another thing just to, you know, have a little bit more fun while you're out there. But if you are a beginner, a mystery tackle box, what that does for you, one, not only does it fill up your tackle box fast by sending you a whole box of baits each month but two it also introduces you to new baits each and every month and it's not like you're going to be stuck with those baits and not know how to use them the box also comes with a little booklet that tells you the names of every bait in it and a little paragraph about how and when to use it and i know a few of y'all are saying well i don't really know if i want to spend 15 dollars to get a box that well I really don't even know if I want or not. Well, that's okay, guys. We got it figured out. If you simply use the promo code GRAYGANG right here, you can get your first box for $5. Now, $5, guys, I know. I don't care how old you are. You can get $5 in a day. Just go out to an old woman's house or like, you know, somebody like Mammy. Just go find somebody like this, like Mammy. Go up to her and say, hey, if I pick weeds for an hour, can I have $5? More than likely, she'll say yes, and she'll probably even give you a pretty good tip, too. And I'm not saying Mr. Tackle Box is just for beginner fishermen. Even for people like me. Guys, I've been fishing for three years, and, you know, I mean, I think. I think I'm good at fishing. I mean, I'm probably not, but I, I feel like I am. And I'm still having a good time out here, you know, playing with the box, looking at the lures, trying to catch fish on baits I've never used before. If you want to go pick up a box, the link is in the description and don't forget to use promo code Grey Gang. However, if you don't want a mystery tackle box, stay tuned because I'm pretty sure I can get at least two more fish today. If you're not part of the Grey Gang, go ahead and subscribe by hitting the button on the top right and feel free to watch some of my past videos on the left. As always, favorite squad, post it up down low. If you want some of this sweet merch, head on over to kennelgray1.com or the link in the description. But besides that, I'll catch you later in tomorrow's video.